Hey everybody, Marcos Vegas here with Mike Alvarado post fight against his fight with Juan Manuel Marquez. Mike, uh, just tell me, you know, what do you think about your performance and really what's going on right now uh, with what you thought of the fight? I gave myself about a B. You know, I showed a lot of heart. You know, I came back from a knockdown. Um, I was exploiting his his age, you know, but you know something that didn't let me jump on the trigger as much, you know. So the fight played out the way it did, but you know it was a huge learning experience, regardless. So you know I'm, I'm happy with my performance. You know I'm safe. God, you know he's in my corner. I get it. You know, going to my my kids and my family. So you know I'm good. So you know I'm, I'm happy with what this what you know this experience in my life. So. It is what it is. I know people ringside mentioned that your punch output was a lot lower than what they felt and what you did in other fights. Uh, talk to me about that. It was kind of hard, it seemed, for you to get his rhythm, right? Yeah, it was, it was hard. You know, he kept me, you know, kind of gun shy a little bit. So, you know, I wasn't able to get that output, what I wanted. So, you know, that's just the way the fight played out. But, you know, I just still thought the fight was a lot closer than what they say. But, you know, it's his hometown and it's, you know, his backyard. So I really had to beat him down. You know, I really had to convincingly beat him every round. So, you know, it's the way the fight went. Talk to me about the knockdown that he scored. It was... It seemed like a feint, and then he landed the shot. And when we looked at it, we're like, "Wow, that was a really tricky thing that he did." You being there in front of him, talk to me. Talk to me about that. Yeah, Marquez. You know, he, he has a way of doing that. You know, that's his experience that that comes out of him. You know, caught me with it, and you know, I recovered. So you know, I was just, I'm just blessed, and I'm just happy that I was able to recover and finish the fight. Were you, were you seeing stars, or were you really hurt, or how was that? Um, I was dizzy, but, you know, I got my head back, you know, on time, so I came back, knocked him down, so you've seen some stars, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, I was going to get to that. Put the stars together. <laughs> <laughs> that, that knockdown that you scored on him, you know, take me through that and what was going on through your mind. Um, I was really trying to jump on him a little bit more. I know he was hurt. He was feeling the power. He was like, man, I hope this guy doesn't really, you know, exploit my age and his, his youth doesn't just overtake this fight, but... You know, that's just the, the trigger wasn't pulled the way I, I wanted to for this fight. But, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pleased with it. I'm happy about my performance. And, I mean, I'm only going to be better. I'm only going to get a lot better from, from here on out. For our cameras, Mike, what do you want to tell the fans that watched you here in L.A. today? I just thank all the fans and all the support from everybody that, you know, and that watched this fight, that got this fight, and that are boxing fans of Juan Manuel and Mike Alvarado. So, you know, God bless everybody and, and thank yous.